Welcome back to Finance Homefront, your go-to destination for insightful discussions on all things finance. I'm your host, Craig, and today we're diving into a topic that's near and dear to every trader's heart, the common mistakes that can sabotage your trading success. Before we get started, I want to remind you that while we'll be sharing valuable insights and strategies, I'm not a financial advisor, and this video is for educational purposes only. Always do your own research and consult with a professional before making any investment decisions. Now, if you're ready to take your trading game to the next level, then you're in the right place. In this video, we'll explore five common trading blunders that even the most seasoned traders fall victim to. From emotional trading to the perilous pursuit of picking tops and bottoms, we'll cover it all. But before we dive in, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. And be sure to leave a comment below with your thoughts and questions. We love hearing from you. All right, let's get started. Trading, with its seemingly simple mechanics of buying and selling assets, masks the complexity that lies beneath the surface. The decision-making process behind these transactions is a labyrinth of emotions, biases, and strategic considerations. In this discourse, we delve into the intricate world of investment decision-making, highlighting five common pitfalls that traders often encounter. 1. Emotional Trading – The Temptation and Its Consequences The allure of financial markets can evoke a range of emotions, from excitement to fear and everything in between. Yet it is the emotions of greed and fear that often cloud judgment and lead to irrational decision-making. The desire to capitalize on a perceived opportunity or to recoup losses can drive traders to make impulsive, emotion-driven trades. For instance, imagine a trader who opens a long position in a stock only to see it plummet shortly afterward. Faced with the prospect of losses, the trader may succumb to fear and panic, making hasty decisions to salvage the situation. This could involve doubling down on the position in a misguided attempt to average down the cost, or worse, opening short positions as a form of retaliation against the market. Similarly, the fear of missing out, FOMO, can compel traders to chase after trends that have already gained momentum, often at the expense of sound judgment. The result is often buying at inflated prices, just as the market is poised for a reversal. In essence, emotional trading not only sabotages rational decision-making, but also puts traders in unnecessary risky situations and adds to potential losses. To navigate these treacherous waters, it is imperative for traders to cultivate emotional resilience and discipline and to base their decisions on a rational assessment of market conditions rather than succumbing to the whims of emotion. Two. Moving the goalposts, rationalizing decisions in hindsight. Admitting failure is never easy, especially in the high stakes world of trading. Yet, refusing to acknowledge mistakes can be even more detrimental in the long run. This phenomenon, known as moving the goalposts, involves rationalizing poor decisions after the fact, rather than accepting responsibility and cutting losses. Consider a scenario where a trader sets a stop order on a position to limit potential losses. As the market moves against them, instead of adhering to their predetermined risk management strategy, the trader may succumb to the temptation to cancel the stop order in the hope that the market will reverse course. This behavior is driven by a reluctance to accept losses and a misguided belief that the situation will eventually turn in their favor. Similarly, traders may resort to adjusting their trading criteria or indicators to justify their actions retrospectively. For instance, if a technical indicator fails to produce the desired outcome, they may switch to a different indicator or time frame in an attempt to salvage the trade. However, such actions are often driven by emotion rather than logic and can exacerbate losses in the long run. To avoid falling into this trap, 
traders must cultivate self-awareness and discipline and adhere to their predefined trading plan without succumbing to the allure of hindsight bias. By accepting losses early and learning from mistakes, traders can protect their capital and position themselves for long-term success. 3. Playing Earnings – Navigating the Perils of Volatility Earnings season often presents traders with tantalizing opportunities to capitalize on market volatility. However, trading around earnings announcements is not without its risks as unpredictable market reactions can result in substantial losses. Despite their best efforts to forecast the direction of a stock's price movement based on fundamental or technical analysis, traders may find themselves at the mercy of market sentiment and investor reactions. Even the most thorough research and analysis can be rendered moot in the face of unexpected earnings, surprises, or market shocks. Moreover, the allure of potential windfall profits can tempt traders to deviate from their risk management strategy and take oversized positions, exposing themselves to undue risk. In the end, the outcome of an earnings trade often hinges on factors beyond the trader's control, making it a gamble rather than a calculated investment. To mitigate the risk associated with trading around earnings, traders should approach such opportunities with caution and employ risk management techniques such as position sizing, stop loss orders, and diversification. By maintaining a disciplined approach and avoiding excessive speculation, traders can navigate earnings season with greater confidence and minimize the impact of unforeseen events. Four, trading the wrong time frame, finding your rhythm in the markets. The pace of trading can vary significantly depending on the time frame, from the rapid fire transactions of day trading to the more leisurely tempo of swing trading. While each approach has its merits, traders must find a time frame that aligns with their personality, preferences, and trading style. For some traders, the fast paced nature of day trading may induce anxiety and overwhelm, leading to impulsive decision making and erratic behavior. Conversely, others may find the slower pace of swing trading to be tedious and uneventful, resulting in boredom and a lack of engagement. Finding the right balance between risk and reward and maintaining discipline in the face of temptation is essential for long-term success in the markets. By adopting a time frame that suits their temperament and lifestyle, traders can minimize stress and emotional strain while maximizing their chances of success. Five, trying to pick tops and bottoms, the elusive quest for market timing. Attempting to pick the exact tops and bottoms of market movements is a notoriously difficult endeavor, fraught with uncertainty and risk. While the allure of capturing maximum profit may be enticing, the reality is that market timing is more art than science, requiring a combination of skill, intuition, and luck. One of the primary challenges of picking tops and bottoms is the fallacy of precision. Markets are complex and dynamic systems influenced by a multitude of factors, making accurate predictions nearly impossible. Moreover, the emotional roller coaster of trying to time the market can take a toll on traders' mental and emotional well being, leading to stress, anxiety, and decision paralysis. Instead of attempting to predict market movements with pinpoint accuracy, traders are better served by adopting a more patient and disciplined approach. Dollar cost averaging, diversification, and risk management are time tested strategies that can help mitigate the impact of market volatility and uncertainty. In conclusion, the decision-making process behind trading is a multifaceted and nuanced endeavor, influenced by a myriad of factors ranging from emotions and biases to market dynamics and risk management. By understanding and avoiding common pitfalls, such as emotional trading, moving the goalpost, playing earnings, trading, the wrong time frame and trying to pick tops and bottoms, traders can enhance their decision-making process and improve their chances of long-term success in the markets. As we wrap up, I want to extend a heartfelt thank you to each and every one of you for tuning in today. 
Your support means the world to us, and we're grateful to have you as part of the Finance Homefront community. If you found value in today's discussion and want to continue leveling up your trading skills, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that like button. By subscribing, you'll stay updated on all our latest content, ensuring you never miss out on valuable insights and strategies. And remember, your feedback is invaluable to us. So please leave a comment below sharing your thoughts, questions, or any topics you'd like us to cover in future videos. We're here to serve you and help you thrive on your financial journey. Until next time, happy trading, and we'll see you in the next video.